so let's take a look at how you can get vertical parallax scroll in gdevelop so first thing make sure you have gdevelop installed and second thing is we need to get the background that's suitable for vertical scrolling so there are plenty of sites out there and i'm using this graphpix.net website here in backgrounds you can find the free background so let's go through that and choose the background okay so there are plenty of free so i'm going to choose the one which suits my case okay so here you can see there are sky backgrounds as well then you have this desert one and few others okay so go with the free one okay. and considering most of the vertical scrolling are space based or water based schemes so you can choose the one that applies so let's see if we go with this fairy tale game background okay so i have downloaded this and i'm going to use that okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to open gdevelop okay now if you have any existing project you can open that okay like say if i have this sample game right and here i have named my first scene as base and here i'm going to drop that background so for that we will add new object and for new object we are going to make use of tile sprite okay because we are making use of use of this particular background that will vertically scroll so we need to use tile sprite and not sprite or any other image okay so choose tile sprite let's name that object as background then select the image choose new image and let's see i have downloaded that particular cloud right now it's visible here and then click on apply now next thing we have to drop this onto our scene and now we have to also vertically expand it as well as a bit of horizontal expansion right now what we can do is we can keep on expanding vertical and here you can see keep expanding till you are satisfied with that range okay so let's start from here right now what what we need to do is we have to check for event for that scene and we have to add action to new event when we click on this add new event we get this add action okay now we have to choose on which object it will apply so background now search for image offset that goes for y-axis so y-axis is your vertical now next thing you have to choose modify assign choose add and for value set 100 sorry now multiply this with time delta right time delta function it will auto complete now click on ok okay now if you come back to events you will see that we have added condition to our background image that adds 100 into time delta so that it moves in y offset so it will keep on now let's come back to our scene and execute 
now here you can see it will move vertically upwards so it will keep on going like your typical vertical parallax okay. right so for endless vertical this type of action can be pretty good so choose the image that suits that scenario some of the image as you can see break with multiple end sprites within them so it doesn't look exactly like that vertical scroller here okay so adjust that according to your game so you get the idea how to create vertical parallax field in gdevelop